it was a good week, you know, not, not only the trip, the, the whole week. So uh, we got a lot of work to do. Um, we got a lot of work to do. Um, we're in a big hole. Um, obviously, we're very talented, but right now, you know, it, it's, it didn't go that way this week. We go home this week and we got to play better. How about the starting pitching this week? Um, yeah, eight over 10 for the eight games. Uh, it wasn't good, and uh, we know it. Um, this team is built around the, the starting rotation, and um, uh, we need to do better. Uh, today, David struggled with his changeup. Uh, the one to Rochella, the one to Maven. Um, um, you know, the fastball command was okay early, but then after that, the changeup kind of like was cutting into the zone, and they put good swings on it. Alex, you had, you had to start more or less under control until the third inning. You had two outs, just one guy. What do you think kind of changed? I think the changeup, you know, he makes a, a, the pitch to Urshela and he just cut into the middle of the zone and, you know, he put a good swing on it and I think Garner after I got on base on a cutter, he hits it's uh, uh, up the end of the bat, but then the next one to Cameron, I think it was, it was another changeup and you know, that that pitch, uh, you know, early on was good, but then in that inning it wasn't and, you know, they, they put good swings on it, you know, they were up in the zone, cut into their, their barrels and they didn't miss them. I mean, there's two outs, you know, we're one pitch away to finishing that and knowing that, you know, we, where we were uh, bullpen wise, we're hoping for him to finish that in and go out again, you know, uh, you know, the fastball was good velocity wise, I think, and location wise early, you know, it's just one of those that just snowball on us and, you know, you, you, you're trying to get one more out because you don't want to put your team in a, in a tough situation, but then, you know, it just kept going and going and we had to go to Darwinson. Oh, we could go at this time. Yeah. What do you think has gone on in this last Well, we, we didn't put uh, games together. You know, uh, we had some close ones uh, at home, but we didn't finish them. We didn't pitch. At one point, you know, offensively, it's been okay, you know, lately. Uh, we, we didn't hit with many scoring position, and then we didn't put pressure on the opposition. So, overall, a horrible week. The team is now seven games behind Oakland and Tampa Bay in, in the last column. How tough will it be to recover from it? Um, we got Kansas City this week, and we got to win the series. We got to start playing, uh, playing better baseball. As the season goes on, does it get harder to believe that the talent of your rotation will surface this year? Um, not really. I mean, we trust these guys. We're gonna roll them out there, and we're gonna keep working to, for them to make adjustments and, and get better. You know, uh, we were talking about it earlier today during the game. You know, it's like you know, we roll 15 days in a row, good pitching. We know we can do it. We did it for seven days, and, and you saw what happened. So, you know, it's no doubt in my mind that these guys can turn around. You used that uh, phrase earlier this week, you know, it's a learning experience for me as well, and you even told us about finding the cards from your daughter. I mean, how are you handling this? It's kind of the biggest adversity you faced as <laughs> a manager and bench coach. Um, I'm good, you know. Um, it's not that people think it was easy last year, just like that, but it wasn't that easy. You know, we had to coach every day, and we put this guys in situations to be successful. So, you know, I keep working. I keep showing up the next day and stay positive. That's what I do here. You know, that's why they hire me here. So, you know, from my end, I believe in these guys and I know they can do it. So just keep showing up every day and putting them in positions to be successful and they will be successful. Are you worried about these guys being able to stay positive just the way no, things are? No, 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 no. I mean, uh, we know that we know where we are and we're going to go home and, you know, that, that green monster is going to remind us where we are. You know, it's, it's, it's no hiding, but uh, we know we're talented and we can do it. It's just a matter of start doing it now. In retrospect, do you think what happened on the trade deadline not doing anything affected this team more than you guys thought about it? I don't think so. I don't think so. I just think, you know, um, we didn't hit, we didn't pitch, we didn't play well. That's it. But I don't think it has to do with uh, uh, making trades or not making trades. You had three key guys this weekend, Betts, Bogarts, and Devers, all really struggled with the plate. Were they pitched well, or did you feel like they were pressing at any point? I don't think they're pressing. I think, you know, it just it happens during the season. You know, they, Rafi and, and Xander, they've been hot for, what, three and a half months, you know, so they're going to run into stretches like this. It just happens that, you know, it happens when we lose seven or eight in a row. But you know, they've been great the whole season, you know, and uh, they, they did a good job. But at the same time, it's going to happen. It's going to happen and somebody else has to pick it up. Okay.